So good evening everybody. I'm in the trailer. It's like 10 o'clock at night and I've thought about this all day. I should tell you about our first day and what happened our first day. So we started out okay and then Carol disappeared and I was watching because I was a lead. I was watching for Carol and she finally showed back up and she told me we our first stop she said oh cuddles jumped over the, the air conditioner and then uh, into her feet. Anyway, scared her to death. She had to pull over, etc., etc., etc. Fine. Then we're going along and we're going along and we really didn't make a lot of progress. So I think it was like 5 o'clock in the evening we had stopped and she said, well, we really need to make it to so-and-so. Can we do it? And I said, I'm really exhausted. I don't know, you know, okay, all right, I'll, I'll do it. What we didn't realize was it was going to turn dark. <laughs> we weren't thinking. We promised ourselves from the very beginning we would not drive in the dark. We had no walkie-talkies, and I can't handle answering the phone because I can't hear the phone if it's on, on my, my stand there. I can't hear it. And number two, it, it closes off turns off itself when I haven't used it for a while. So then when somebody calls you, you got to unlock it, put the code in, pick it, and then answer. I mean, it's just crazy. So she kept trying to call me. I kept saying, don't call, don't call. I can't answer. I can't answer. You know, because we were supposed to have walkie-talkies. Anyway, it turns coal black. There's construction everywhere on the roads. Horrendous construction. I mean, it was just crazy, and they had these these large barrel, uh, orange and white barrels, that they blocked off one lane, and you'd be in one, the other lane. I think I was in the left-hand lane at this time. And Carol changes her mind, says, decides that she wants to pull over and we want to go to, to sleep, because uh, we don't want to be driving in the dark. The problem is, I can't find my phone, and it's ringing. I finally find my phone. And I finally get around to calling her. I'm driving with one hand in a construction, one lane, these orange barrels. She goes, well, I think I want to stop and, and go save. And I'm like, okay, I can't answer my phone. All right, all right, all right. You know, and she said, so stop at the Elko exit. And I go, okay. Well, I don't know how many exits are in Elko, right? And about that time, I hit one of those orange barrels. And something, bang, pop. Uh, just scared the living day. I said, gotta hang up. I'm yelling at Carol, you know. Gotta hang up. Gotta hang up. So, drop the phone. I I don't know how much damage I've done. I'm trying to stay on the road. Well, there's three eggs at Telco. <laughs> and I'm like, three exit. Which exit does she want me to take? She said the Elko exit. So, I'll take the middle exit. Then I only have a short way to go either way. If I have to go forward because she wants to stop on the third one or back if she wants to stop the first one. So then I pull over and I'm driving and this little town has these little curbs. You can't see. I can't see at night very well at all. I don't drive at night. So anyway, Carol calls me again. <laughs> and I'm, I hit the curb. I went right over, flying over this little curb for a turn. I mean, they had them, wherever you turn, they had these little curbs. <laughs> Another bang, and I'm like, oh my gosh. I finally pull into a, a closed store parking lot because it's dark. I, I, I can't even tell you which one. And I call her back. She goes, I told you to take the Elko exit. I said, there's three exits. I did the middle so I could... Which one are you at? She goes, well, the first exit. I'm like, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, it was such a mess. And I said, you know, I, I just hit one of those barrels and I hit something else and everything pounded and knocked and, and now I just hit a curb and blah. So I was, a, I was stressed out. So I finally get back on and I go and there, Carol and I had a nice sleep. But the next day, the next day, day two, I'll tell you about day two another time. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Oops. Camo.